नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज फ्रॉम मीरा आई एम अ देवी डिवोटी बट आई कैन नॉट विजिट आश्रम नाउ एवर सिंस द लॉकडाउन आई फील वेरी एंक्शियस एंड फियरफुल ऑल द टाइम इज देर अ वे आई कैन इन्वोक देवी ग्रेस ऑन अ डेली बेसिस वाह what is consecrated as devi is a physical form here the moolasthanam or the root form is here but if her influence was just limited to the temple she is not worth wasting our time and energy on her influence is not determined by the physical space wherever you are if your doors are open it's available any genuinely you must understand there are two different kinds of images or two different kinds of consecrations one is just a reverberation you can you can even make this vessel reverberate but uh, you cannot access this vessel from elsewhere because it's simply reverberating without specificity of what it intends to do it has no intention or intelligence but consecrations which are as complex as the devi or much more with the dhyana linga is they are not limited by physical space many many people the first time it happened in united states i think this was just the second program in the engineering program we were doing uh there was a lady who was involved in all kinds of uh, you know whatever certain type of work from caribbean islands she went on doing something with her pencil in the book you know we have a problem with people taking down notes i said no you cannot take notes just be with me she will be looking at me not even looking at the book just looking at me and just doing this with her pencil then uh, at the end of the 3 hour session she said i don't know why this came something came out of this and this is the thing that you know the form that came out of me i didn't know what happened as i was looking at you i was trying to sketch you but this is what i got it's a clear proportion of the dhyana linga that that must be still in our archive somewhere she just got the image of dhyana linga like she completely the whole page she scratched with her pencil what was left unscratched was just the form of dhyana linga exactly the same exact proportion <laughs> but she was trying to make a picture of me so i am telling you consecrated forms are not limited to its physical space and you being anxious well you have this choice every one of you have this choice you can use this mind either to create well being or misery for yourself this is one thing you have to come to terms with you must understand if you're feeling wonderful right now it must be because of you if you're feeling terrible right now it is because of you other things may stimulate but essentially all human experience is caused by you you and you alone how much are you enslaved to external situations is simply determined by how compulsively reactive you are if you're very reactive what is around you will determine how you are right now if you are a conscious response to the world in which you live your well being will be very much in your hands devi's grace can be used for something much higher than just beating your anxiety <laughs>